Welcome to this product video. Over the next few minutes, we will show you how an approver can approve, reject, or forward an invoice by using Columbus Vendor Invoice Manager for Microsoft Dynamics AX. Additional videos can be viewed at www.columbusglobal.com. Vendor Invoice Manager can help you significantly reduce manual processing and boost proactivity by automating steps that require traditional multitask invoice processing. It strengthens supplier relationships with timely payments and more efficient handling. It also accelerates processing cycles and takes advantage of all the payment discounts. With Vendor Invoice Manager, automatic notifications are sent to remote approvers, and it supervises to ensure the approval in a timely manner. Vendor Invoice Manager takes care of different types of cost invoice, such as expense invoice, project invoice, fixed asset invoice, and purchase order invoice. In this demonstration, we will see how an approver can approve, reject, or forward the invoice to another approver in either the delivery stage or the payment approval stage. As Accounts Payment Manager, I'm going to check on which invoices are waiting for my approval. In this screen, as we can see, there are many invoices waiting for my approval. Some of them are purchase invoices, and some of them are cost invoices. We can also see that some are in delivery approval and some are waiting for me for payment approval. Let's take one of the cost invoices to proceed with the demonstration. As an approver, I have a choice to either approve this invoice, reject this invoice, or forward this invoice. Let's see who all are responsible for approving this invoice. In this case, it is me and John who can approve this invoice. In this scenario, we will see how to reject this invoice. As we can see, the account that has been used for this is insurance expense. But the invoice is about office supplies. This needs to be corrected and therefore I send this invoice back to the bookkeeper to validate and confirm the right account for this invoice. That's why we select the option Reject. We select the correct hold code, which is, in this case, Wrong Ledger Entry. We also can add a note to the rejection. In this case, we say, please change the ledger account to Office Supplies. When we click on OK, the invoice has been rejected. As a bookkeeper, I get the rejected invoice in my active invoices, and we can see there's a hold code attached to it. I can also see the notes and who has sent these notes. As the bookkeeper, I have to correct the invoice. In this case, the account has to be changed to office supplies. Once this is done, we have to update or remove the reject code to make sure the invoice can be forwarded for approval. In this case, the invoice has been forwarded for delivery approval. This ends the product demo of Vendor Invoice Manager for Microsoft Dynamics AX. For more information, please visit www.columbusglobal.com. Thank you for watching.